Welcome back to a new video here in Swabi. In this video, I will show you how to make a fake camera movement. Stay until the end because I will show you how to download these for free. Now, the first thing you're going to need is the clip that you're using. And this is how it looks with the fake camera movement. And this is how it looks without it. We're going to right click here and we're going to open this in Fusion. We're going to press Ctrl and Spacebar to open the menu. And we're going to add a transform node. On the transform node where it says center, we're going to right click and we're going to create a path. That means that we can now draw something in here. That's going to be the starting point and that's going to be the second point. You can add a curve and also make these like this. Now in the modifier, you will be able to animate the actual movement of the image following the path. As you can see here, the whole image is moving when we use the displacement slider. If you're looking for some freebies for DaVinci Resolve, check out my website suave.com and also you can find some paid assets there too. Now for these camera movements, there's always going to be a need for a little bit of zoom in into your scene. So we're going to have to make these a little bit bigger and then we're going to adjust the path accordingly. Now before we do anything else, we're going to right click right here and we're going to modify these with an anim curves. That way it's going to be automatic once you apply these effect on any clip that you have. For the scale, we're going to leave these at 1, which means that the displacement is going to be at 1 when it reaches the ending point right here. What we can do now is go and we can actually adjust the path that we have here. We're going to grab this point and we're going to adjust these to whatever we want these to start. And if we go to the last frame right here, now we can position this one. We're going to hold Ctrl and select the other one. And now we can position these a little bit like that. Now, if we look at these, now we have the camera movement, which if you ask me, it does add a little bit of a special touch to the clip. If you don't want to go through the process of building from scratch, I'm going to leave the files for these in the link in the description. Just go there, fill up the form, and then you can download the files right there.